So welcome to a new series on the channel and this is one that I've been seeing, well, two GIFs basically just circulate over on Twitter like non-stop. I've been seeing so many renditions of those two GIFs, one of them being from episode one, I'm guessing, which was the one with the feet, the stockings, and I was like, God, why can't I watch this right now? And the other one being the sister one, um, <laughs> the wake up, uh, that scene, that GIF everywhere on my timeline everywhere like so many renditions of it and i've been so 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 eager to see it in context because it's it's a wild gif so i'm excited to see this the reason i haven't watched it yet is because i was away in la for anime expo for the past two weeks so i've been i didn't watch anything so now i'm catching up and finally it's time to catch up to this one um there are three episodes out or there are two as of recording and the other one is coming out later today and i'm gonna just package it all as a one uh, episode one through three so you're gonna be able to watch all three of them in one video and then starting from here we're gonna be watching this weekly on the channel every wednesday okay so i know that this is animated by doga kobo which is a goated studio especially in the past like two three years they've been doing god's work uh especially in things like well oshinoko or jellyfish can swim in the night um so i'm excited to see what they've been cooking up with this one um i heard that it's really really good all I know about it is that it's about a tsundere, I'm guess, I'm guess, I'm guessing, or uh, I'm pretty sure they called it uh, rushidere. Um, I'm pretty sure that's like the uh, Japanese tag for the title. And she is half, I don't know if she's half Russian, half Japanese, but I saw the trailer for this. So I think it's like she teases the guy in Russian, not knowing that he can or like she teases him in like japanese but in russian she like compliments him or something like that but she doesn't know that he actually understands russian so that's a wild concept but i'm here for it i heard that uh, sumire uesaka is gonna be voicing alia which i'm excited to see i was at a ax and sumire uesaka was on a panel for it and she said that she actually did do uh, some russian back in high school so that's why she was able to basically guarantee this role um or she was better at auditioning for this role so it's gonna be cool to see um sumira Uyasaka bring alia to life because she's an incredible va and also of course doga koba working on it that's just a recipe for success so i'm excited for it i don't know i'm guessing this is gonna be just like a high school romance i'm guessing that's gonna be the main maybe like a bit of comedy um that's my guess i don't know anything else about it uh, is there anything else I wanted to say? I don't think so, because, yeah, as I said, I think it's a light novel adaptation, correct me if I'm wrong. I think it's not a manga, it's a light novel adaptation, I think so. I think it also has a manga, though, um, but I'm excited to watch it, and I heard that the light novel is really good as well. So, anyways, um, if you want to watch this, Uncut and Unblurred, it's gonna be on my Patreon, because on YouTube I have to, obviously, blur it, edit it, like because of youtube also i'll have to cut the opening and the ending from the youtube reaction but i always do listen to them on my patreon which is down in the description it's one dollar a month um which is the lowest paywall i can set it to there's no like tier systems or anything like that it's just one dollar you get everything that i ever blur on youtube is unblurred on my patreon all the anime and stuff like that so yeah as i said down in the description um yeah as i said i'm gonna be listening to the opening and the ending for the first time in i'm guessing episode one or episode two if episode one doesn't have them um and it's gonna be basically patreon exclusive just because yeah i don't wanna um get copyrighted on youtube anyways is that all i wanted to say i think so so without further ado let's go into alia sometimes hides her feelings in russian episode one Sere academy that sounds prestigious nice So that's Alia, right? I see him post the poster. Yep, that's Alia. I heard it's that she's a tsundere, which hey, I'm a tsundere enjoyer. Whoa, woo, woo, woo. Wait, I, I I popped, I messed up with my uh oh no wait okay good <laughs> my OBS was starting to act up because I I was <laughs> I was uh trying to pause it here. Okay, Alisa Mikhail Mikhailovna Kujo. Born to a Russian father, her grades are top of the school, she also ex she's also excellent at sports. Starting this year, she serves as a student council treasurer. Oh, so she's like Ishigami from Kaguya-sama. Okay, she's the treasurer, the financial advisor type of person. Okay, that's cool. <laughs> yeah, I heard that she's a tsundere, according to Sumire Uyasaka. She said that that's her main charm for point. Oh, yes. Yeah, Ando. 
He's kind of cool. She has a sister, okay. Oh, she's the first year, I'm guessing. Oh, yeah. Poor guy. Hey, I respect. I respect the hustle. Wow. Wow. I respect the, the confidence that he had. Ah, no! I'm not gonna say anything. Nice. Poor guy! The most coveted. Yeah, 1B, okay. First year. So do they know each other? Ah, watch it real time. On the forums? Ah! Actually saying Twitter? <laughs> I guess I didn't say it in the dub. From Japanese. Rare form. Here it is. I do not understand Cyril or um, Russian for that, for that matter. I love her energy though. The Tsundere energy is strong with this one. Yeah! The Tsundere energy is so strong with this one. I am excited. <sighs> yeah, you and me both. Ah! Nice. She's a hustler. Get hustled for some extra social points. Lies and slander. <laughs> I, I don't understand it. Please, please. I'm pretty sure. It means like cute or something like that. Yup. He understands Russian, right? Okay, okay, okay. Ah, oh, this is gonna be so good. Oh! Cute. That's cute. Opening! Let me pause it here. Uh, as I said, if you're watching this on YouTube, it's gonna be a sudden cut here because I have to cut it out, but the full reaction to the opening, which is this is my first time listening to it, is gonna be on Patreon, so link in the description. Okay, banger. Okay, here we go, exposition. Okay. Hey. Nah, you can't. You can't. You have to. <laughs> you have to bottle it up. 
You can blackmail her even more later on. <laughs> wow, true. It's a daily reset. Let's go. No, Alia, you don't understand. SSR? Bro. Alia! Damn. Bro, it's his FGO account. Oh shit, she's really damn bad for him. Hmm, sure. Damn fighting words. Game joke. Yo, that's true. Hey, you can say anything if you're free to play. Whoa, preach, brother. The F2P superiority. Wow. <laughs> Yo, he's a fellow FTP gacha player. They're like the um, NPCs from Eminence and Shadow. Secretary? Oh! Her sister! Yuki. Oh, is this the girl? Is this the girl that we saw the gif of? I'm pretty sure it is. Ah, that's an excuse. She doesn't. <laughs> they don't know. I'm not gonna say anything actually. Ah. She's... Yeah, she does not look like she's in your league. Sorry, boy. Sorry, my man. Yeah? What? What's happening here? No. Oh, okay, okay. The guy kind of reminds me of uh, Hachiman from uh, Oregairu. Kind of. Or I guess maybe the guy from uh, Bunny Girl Senpai. Slightly less based, but still. Nice. Yeah, true. <laughs> I like her voice. I feel like I know her voice. 
Oh, someone's jealous. Ah, oh, Osana Nanami. Osana Na. I don't know how they call it. How they know. How it is. Childhood friends. <laughs> it's a process. Alisa. She's so smug. Wait, maybe she's not the, the person from the gift. But I thought her name was Yuki. Also, did she call her Alisa? So smug. What position? Mm. Oh shit. She's not going like that. Yeah, <laughs> that's a jab at him. <laughs> She's so cute. Oshiruko. Wow. Wow. Ooh. Hey, I appreciate the fact that he has th says things out loud, you know, he's not too embarrassed about it. That's cool. He's a bit more assertive than the usual romance per tag. Back. Flash back flash. Flashback? Oh. So that's the girl that he was hanging out with. The Russian girl. I feel like this is gonna be an important word. Ah, someone had a crush. Oh! Ooh! Someone had a bit of a childhood romance going on there. Wait! Wait, 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 wait. pause, pause, pause. Ah, okay, no. <laughs> okay. I don't know why. For a second, this poster in the back, I. My brain was going. Because this is Dogokobo. I was like, I thought it was Saya Hime from um, Oshinoko. Oh my god, I thought that Dogokobo did like a cross promotion. No, it's not. It's not. It's not. It's from uh, his FGO like gacha game. Okay. Ah, she's gonna be somewhere. Top of the morning to you. Okay, Jack. Perfectionist. Wait, aren't they still crooked? Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> 
Ah. Oh, I have a feeling this is the scene. Guys, don't freak out. That's fair. It's up to you, go, my boy. <laughs> the change in tone. Fast. The animation, man! Wait, I didn't see the full game. I only saw the feet. <laughs> yeah, the smug smile. Ma'am! <laughs> As thanks. Yeah. <laughs> I mean, yes. I mean, I was about to say. It's surely not because... Oh yeah, maybe. It probably is, yeah. But it's definitely not because she likes you. Betsuni? <laughs> Bro, she would die of embarrassment. Damn! Damn! Yo, I love him. Yo! Average male fantasy. <laughs> Dude, Sumira Uesaka is doing such a great job. Yo! Damn! The animation is insane on this scene though. Oh! Oh! Damn! Wait, we got... Okay, you know what? No comment. No comment, that was extremely well animated. Also, yeah, sounds, yeah, yeah. <laughs> you know what? I feel like he's not gonna be too upset over this exchange. I feel like he's the winner here. Sister of my beloved brother. Stay calm and hear me out. Uh oh. Oh no. I mean, legs are lit. Okay, I feel like I should be pausing it a bit. I feel like I have so much to say. Okay, what the fuck? Why was it animated so well? Like, that was such an insanely well anim animated scene with like all of the um, the socks. The clothes are so hard to animate, like all of the uh, crumples in it and stuff like that. And then the feet being so well animated. Obviously, just everything else, like the underwear, everything being so incredibly well animated. And Sumire Uesaka, she was going in in that scene, man. And I feel like... At the end, our boy left that exchange as a big, big winner. I feel like he was the one who ended up winning that. I love how, um, I love how freaking confident he was. He just, he was like, you know what? <laughs> You're trying to tease me. I, I'm not gonna lose this exchange. I'm, I'm gonna grab your leg and I'm gonna go through with um, your proposal. Even though you try to embarrass me, I'm gonna embarrass you. You know what? What a Chad. What a Chad. Absolute Chad. And then he pulled like a um, Gojo from My Dress Up Darling. Hey, hey. It happens. It happens. What a Chad. And now he has a thing for feet. Can't blame him. Yeah, I can't deny this one. Can't deny this one. Betsuni? Betsuni? 
Yeah, I feel like he liked it. Mm. Yeah. Nice. Nice. He knows what he likes. Ah. Im. Ah. <laughs> yeah, that's it. Ah. Nah, he's doing it on purpose. He likes it. <laughs> Spare a thought. <laughs> I really like this guy. Damn animation! Okay, I see you. Okay. Oh, this is gonna be so good, man. It's completely shaken up. It's gonna explode in her... It's gonna explode in her face. It's gonna explode! Don't do it! Porridge? Shiruko, Shiruko porridge. I don't know what that is. Oh, it didn't explode. No, don't answer it. Don't answer it. Nice, nice, nice. No, that's correct, that's correct. That's correct. You need to keep up the facade for as long as possible. You're getting... Clueless. Clueless. Absolutely clueless. No, he's collecting... He's collecting blackmail material. It's all part of the plan. Let's go, ending! Oh, what a banger of an ending, man. Okay. Dude, this ending is so hype. Okay, anyways. Um, let's talk about this episode. Insane. Incredible first episode. Jesus Christ, this was so good. Man, I really like how our guy is not... He's not, like, the... On the same level as someone like uh, Hachiman or... I don't remember... Oh, I really should know the name. But the guy from Barney Girl Senpai. Because those two are, like... At least in my mind, those two are... The main examples of like the extremely fr like based like just completely confident um main characters that are really good at like bantering and stuff like that he does seems like he's in between that and like a more typical romance protagonist he does get a bit flustered at times um which i think is really cute i feel like it's rare to see a character that's um not on one side of the extreme um you know, but he's like kind of somewhere in between. Um, maybe it makes him even a bit more realistic that way, you know. I really like him. I really, really like him. He knows what he likes and he's still discovering what he likes. <laughs> I think he's going to be into many new things. He's discovering many new kings uh, as we speak. So that's going to be interesting to, to see. Uh, I really want to see how his sister, um, like who his sister is, because she seems like like, they seem like they have an incredible relationship. Like, he was talking to her about feet, and she was like, you know what? Man of culture. You you have great taste. Uh, I res I, I, she was like, you know what? I can see why. <laughs> I, I respect that. I respect that. Um, look, I saw that gif, and I was like, I'm not into feet. But <laughs> that was my initial thought. I was like, you know what? I need to watch this. So, um, yeah. Here we are. Here we are. Here we are. Okay, the animation is incredible in this. The voice acting is... Top notch, like insane, top notch, top notch. Um, and I'm excited to see where like the story goes. I wonder how, like judging by the opening, he's gonna join the student council, right? Uh, obviously, and obviously judging by how they were talking about it, it seems like 
it would be the conc the logical conclusion that he's gonna end up joining the student council. Um, so that's gonna be interesting to see. I wonder what position he's gonna get. Is he gonna be the vice president once again? And I wonder if there's gonna be like a love triangle with Yuki and Alia. Um, I don't know. And uh, Kuza, right? Kuza's his name. Uh, I don't know. I guess we'll find out. And I wonder who the girl, the blonde Russian girl from his flashback is. Because it feels like she... Um, maybe she's like... I'm trying to remember what Alia's sister looks like. Looks like. No. Alia's sister has like light brown hair. So it, I don't think it's gonna be her. It's obviously not Alia because of the difference in hair. And obviously they would remember each other. Like... Surely. That feels a bit... Mm, I don't know, it feels a bit too cliche if it was just straight up just Alia. I feel like it's someone connected to Alia, but not Alia herself. Um, he doesn't remember her name, so maybe the reason that's gonna be used is, in a way is like, it has the same last name as Alia or something like that, maybe. Or it's gonna be a completely, uh, like, completely separate person who's gonna end up being introduced later on. I don't know, but it's gonna be surely someone that we're gonna meet uh, eventually. It feels like it's leading up to that. I'm excited to see who that person's gonna end up being as well. This, man, okay, let me just stop talking. We have a lot of episodes to go through, so let's just go into episode two. Yuki, you Nice. <laughs> Bro, their chemistry is actually really cool. <laughs> yeah, you are. A bit. <laughs> She's really smug. Monopoly? Why does she call her Alisa? Was her name Alia Alisa? <laughs> she is a bit of an exhibitionist. Yeah, that does feel like it's a bit of an exhibitionist kind of king. Even if he, she thinks that he doesn't understand. Cool. Sumira Uesaka sings the so much for childhood friends. Sings the opening. I didn't know that. I'm pretty sure that's what it said in the credits. Yeah, he looks cool. He's built like a brick shit house, like a one piece character. I wonder if, she, if Yuki knows about the Russian girl he was hanging out with. I wonder how far back they go. Also, Masachika doesn't sound like the most common Japanese last name. Or is that his name? 
Who's that? I guess Kuzai is his name. He's selling it. Nice. He just like me for real. Junior. Okay, so I was gonna say that because in the opening, uh, we can see Alia and um, Kuze ra like walking together towards the podium, right? So I was thinking maybe um, Alia is gonna become the president, maybe because it looked like Alia was going to give a speech on the podium and Kuze was going up behind her. So I thought that maybe those two are gonna be president and vice president, but let's see. That's cool. Nice, good timing. That's. I mean, that's not that expensive, considering how weak the yen is. Betsuni? <laughs> Nice. Ah, sister, parent or mother, sister. Ah, wait, it was her. I like her a lot. I like her energy a lot. I like her. Wait. <laughs> Wait. Wait. Pause. Pause. <laughs> Wait. I thought they were gonna have like a um, love triangle. What's happening here? I, I... <laughs> ah, you know, for a second I saw her when um, they first was were first shown in the cafeteria. I saw her, and I was like, Yuki. Was, is she his sister? And then I saw, and I was like, wait, what was her last name? I'm pretty sure her last name was different than his. And I was like, okay, no, she's his childhood friend. Okay, I wonder who the sister is gonna end up being. And then I was looking in the opening, and I was like, I don't think any of these people are his sister. Who's his, who's the mythical sister? That, now the gif, the gif that I saw, wake up my brother or whatever, that makes sense, because I thought it looked kinda like her. Kinda like her, the, the gif. Makes sense. Makes sense. I did not for a second, like, for a millisecond, I didn't even think that she was actually playing the role of his uh, childhood friend and she was actually his sister. I did not even for a second think that th this is the way we're gonna go. Wow! <laughs> Winces? No! No! 
True, true. They're not related by blood. No, <laughs> she's too far gone. She's too far gone, guys. She's too far gone. She's been reading way too much. Actually, I'm not gonna spoil anything. Ha 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 ha. I'm not gonna say it. You probably know what I'm talking about. Uh, maybe, maybe. If you've been on Twitter for the past few months, then you probably know what I'm talking about. Uh, but she's been reading up on it, man. She is. She's definitely a fan of that manga. Anyways, um. I was gonna say something. Oh yeah, did you see that Doga Kobo is uh, animating the new manga of Reiji? What's his name? Reiji something. The mangaka of Rent a Girlfriend, and that manga is gonna be about a guy who has like five or something like that um, sisters, and then they find out that they're actually not blood related, and then they all start just basically going at it together. So that's gonna be crazy. Uh, that's gonna be a crazy manga. Uh, that's gonna be a crazy adaptation. We are watching that on the channel when it comes out. It's by Doga Kobo. Look, look, I have a feeling Yuki would watch it, so I'm, I'm gonna watch it. Oh my god. Actually, Yuki may, might not... So I've seen, <laughs> I've seen this GIF so many times on Twitter, on my timeline, because there have been so many artists doing different interpretations of this GIF, of like different characters. Jesus fucking Christ, Doga Kobo, you did not have to snap this hard. They went with the POV shot as well. What? <gasps> Jesus! Double Kobo really the masters of incest. Domestic violence. It's a domestic. Jesus fucking Christ! No! No! A monster. Yes. No! You don't understand it, Yuki. It's... Oh my god. I, I love Yuki, okay? I, she's, she's insane. <laughs> what am I watching? Yo, preach, preach. Me at AX. Imoto, yo. Onichan sama. Are they gonna play it off? <laughs> okay. <laughs> Chuni. Chuni. She's so smart. <laughs> Their hair is the same. This is insane. This is so unhinged.
Oh no, Miles. That sounds like my that sounds like my place. Yo. Hey. Damn. That looks sick. Restaurant. That sounds good. Insane. I would love to go to this kind of restaurant. I love spicy food. Yup, yup. You're gonna have to explain somehow. <laughs> That's not the way. That's not the way. No, no. Of course, she's such a she's she's such a brat. She's such a brat. She's such a devil. Oh my god, he's gonna spit out the water. Look at this. <laughs> no explanation. Leave it at that. No. That looks good. I mean, that looks great. You got this, Alia. Watch your clothes! It's splashing a lot, you have white clothes on. That's not gonna be a good experience. <laughs> oh no. I'm sweating just watching this. <laughs> I wonder if um, Yuki can uh, understand her. I don't know if Yuki ever played with the girl outside. That's insane. That's like pure capsaicin. No! Of course she is! She's a devil! She's a devil's... Yo, she's the devil's little worker. Aya, that's pure capsaicin. No! Oh 
Oh my god. You alive. Yo, wait for the next day. Until you go to the toilet. You're not gonna be okay. That's the real struggle. Yes. Ice cream's gonna help a lot, actually. Three scoops? I guess she didn't eat much lunch, did she? Oh, there seems to be more to that. I feel like there is more to that. I feel like there is a reason. You answer that way too boldly. Oh, he's being pressured. Oh, that wasn't Yuki, was it? I mean, <laughs> Alia is not questioning <laughs> anything about Yuki and um, Kuze at all. She's like, you know what? I guess, I guess, I, I, I guess it is what it is. I'm not questioning it. <laughs> you know what? Sure. <laughs> She's just keeping their um, <laughs> private life private, I guess. I respect that. Mm. You said that you're the one who said that they're friends. And you're friends. Nice. <laughs> sense of justice. Yeah, sense of justice kicked in. No, it's not patronizing at all. He's not patronizing you, Alia. Don't worry about it. Oh, the pout. <laughs> Yo. Cameraman? Cameraman? Out here. Out. Cameraman. Cameraman. Out here with you. Cameraman! 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 I'm not saying anything. I am a neutral party here. I'm not saying anything. I have the right to remain silent. He would enjoy that. Okay, let's go. Wow, okay, okay. Wait, professional. Nice. Professional analysis. Okay. <laughs> that does seem like it. No, dude. She's so adorable. <laughs> ah. Ah. Well. Oh, 
Oh, that's cute. <laughs> she's getting addicted to it. No, she's extorting him. Of all the compliments. He must be getting bored. Hey, you read him like a book. Damn. Ah. Uh, <laughs> oh, no, she knows what he knows. Okay, now we this now we know how this works. <laughs> oh no. This is way too good. Nah, this is absolute cinema, man. This is peak. Skank? <sighs> Don't worry about it. Don't worry about it, Alia. <gasps> Kawaii Kiteko Man! <gasps> This ending, oh my god, this anime is incredible, this ending is incredible, Sumire Uesaka is the best. Um, anyway, peace. Okay, but let's go back to the actual, this is, I'm gonna keep all of this in the, um, Patreon, uh, reaction, by the way. Okay, let's go back to it. This episode, oh my god. Oh my god, this episode was even better than the first one. Um, the first one was good, it developed, like, the characters, or, like, it showed us the characters, but this one just went all, like, pulled out all of the, uh, all of the uh, breaks. Like, Yuki, absolutely unhinged. Unhinged. She is insane. Insane. Like, holy shit. Okay, I genuinely wonder. No. Unless, no, 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 there's no way that they're gonna go, it's gonna just be a, like a joke, right? That they're gonna, like, that Yuki always gonna, is always gonna tease Kuze, and, like, she's gonna always make Alia think that they maybe are in, like, a relationship or something like that. But it's always gonna just stay as a joke, right? Surely. Um, but apart from that, um, I've fucking love this anime man the animation on that scene ah man they know what they're doing on, not just that scene but also the scene that she was ch where she was changing the cameraman i can't I, I don't think i can talk too much about it because um i'm not trying to um say anything that i'm not supposed to say so that's Let's leave it at that. But um, I really like Kuza. He was just like um, giving compliments to her because he's like, whew, she doesn't have any friends. Damn, I guess I have to do it. <laughs> and then, then she stepped on a landmine and Yuki arrived. Damn, that was a sad, sad day for Alia. She's gonna... I wonder what she's gonna think about why they went off at the same station. Is she gonna think that they just live next to each other or is she actually gonna start suspecting that they are um, siblings? I don't know. Because, to me, the... M I guess the more sensible... Um, the more sensible... S not solution. What am I trying to say? Um, like, the more sensible way of thinking would be that they are just living close to each other, right? I feel like that would be... Uh, that would make a lot of sense. But maybe she's gonna start suspecting that may they may be related. I don't know. I guess we'll find out. I guess we'll find out in maybe the next episode. Um, so yeah, I guess without further ado, let's go into Alia episode 3. And so they met. Hey, 
Ah, it's her sister. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Masha, Masha. Does she have a bit of a uh, accent? Maybe. Maybe not. Oh, she's down about it. Ah, of course. Of course she does. <coughs> ah, she knows. Oh, she knows. We have some great siblings this season or this in this anime. Yes. Nice. So proud. Different slackers. That's a good description of them. Oh, okay. Finally. I was wondering. Vladivos Vladivostok? Okay, okay. Okay. Nice. She's adorable. Yes. They're going full in on like a full on Russian flashback. That's crazy. Yeah, Oh, that's me. Let's die, let's die. Okay. Damn! Is that a sign wave? Actually, it was a cosine, right? Yeah. Oh, poor thing. God, I was not like Alia at all in school. I was just hanging out. Poor thing. I guess she is really um, ambitious. I guess she is also a valedict valedictorian. Wow, that's a that's a word. So she lived in Russia for five years. And this is where they first met. Oh! 
Wait, her name, her name was Alisa. Her name was never Alia. Oh, my bad. He's such a chill dude. I really like him. I would like to be friends with that kind of guy. He's just cool. He's just vibing. Ha. So that's why she was she isn't a fan of slackers. I see different slackers. Because it clashes with her uh, personality. Or like with her experiences in the past. Mm. I mean, that's how I will also think. <laughs> but. Alia doesn't. Ah. Uh, yeah. Another one. That's admirable. Here he comes. やっぱりまだ。あ。くせ Oh, that's cool. Like a workshop. <laughs> pull some strings. Uh, oh, to pull some strings. Okay, okay. Of course. Pretty good at manipulating people. Wow, she's serious. Damn, the animation, the hair animation. And Sumire killing it. Killing it with the voice acting. No, oh, that's how it started. I mean, he is right, though. He's smart. Let's go. 
Oh, she's a ghost? That's cute. Say it a fall festival. Nice. They got the award. Is he gonna ask her to dance? Princess. She does give out that vibe, at least here. In the present, she doesn't. I guess. Wow, wow, confident. Confidence. That's fair. Hey, that's fair. I like that. Oh. <laughs> yeah, that's it. He's trying to claim the glory. <laughs> you guys are NPCs. You have no... You have no chance. What's her move, Kuza? That's it. That's it. Wow, she's taken. That's what he says. Watch the stairs. I mean, he is cool. Wow. <laughs> They're cute. They're cuties. And that's how it all went down. Makes sense. That's why she likes him. And now we're back in the present. 
<laughs> He's gonna get turned on, Alia. <laughs> oh, no, we're not back. That was right after that, okay. Now we're back in the present. Classic. Classic Roncom. What? What? Does she actually have a boyfriend? Was? What happened? Why are you speaking about him in the past tense? No. Wait, no, that. But the girl back then had blonde hair, not white hair, and she had blue eyes. So she couldn't be either Alia or neither Alia, neither uh, Masha. Unless her hair has changed from blonde to silver, which wouldn't be that uncommon, I guess. When you're a child, like a lot of children have blonde hair and then when they grow up, th that hair changes, especially when you're really young. I don't know how young she was there, but would it really be Alia? Maybe. That's... I feel like it's leading up to that. I mean, that would be the most... She knows. Yeah, it feels like that would be... That would be the bar by far the most obvious one, right? But I don't know if they're going for like a double... Yeah, I don't know if they're going for like uh, trying to double psych me out. Because I'm like, okay, it would be way too obvious for that to be Alia. So I'm like, it has to be someone else. But then maybe they're going... Maybe they're thinking, oh, he, they're gonna think that it's gonna be too obvious. So we're gonna do a double uh, fake out, you know? And it's actually gonna be Alia. I don't know. <laughs> nah, he looks like a softy. <laughs> he does. Yeah. <laughs> 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 
したらありゃ相当苦労してんだろうな久世君ここよああはいマーシャさん預かりますよああありがとうじゃあアーリャニャンをよろしくねアーリャニャンアーアーリャニャンあらーニャンはわーうハ<笑>ハ、えー、いいじゃないほら紅茶を見るんでしょはいはいありがとうございますファーストフラッシュだから渋みがあってねえ久世君誰がいいと思ういや俺は紅茶わからないんでそうあの母親にいろいろ教えられてるユキならこういうとこにされるんだろうイエーイ。That's pretty normal nowadays. だったら僕。Oh. これは父さんについていくよ。<笑>ごめんね、兄様。私はこの家に残るね。And so he decided to stay with her? I'm guessing? どうかした ?Interesting. The older sister vibes. Cute. Oh. <laughs> <laughs> I felt that. Oh, that's it? Was that special ending for purely Alia and her sister and Mish Misha? Masha? Uh, interesting. This, the production values on this are crazy. We're, we, this is the third ending, the third different ending. That's crazy. Um, but apart from that, this was a different episode again. Um, I really enjoyed it. So we got to learn more about Alia's sister. And we got to see the entire past of why Alia is the way she is, and also why, how their relationship between Alia and Kuza developed, right? That's cool. And we. Wait,、uh, what was I gonna say? And yeah, it was just nice getting like the entire、um, exposition, right? Behind all of the characters. Also, we got to see a little bit of Kuza's、um, backstory, just a tiny bit. So their parents divorced, and then he was gonna go with his dad, but his sister、uh, fell sick. And so I'm guessing he decided to stay with、um, his sister, which would in turn mean with his mom, I'm guessing.、Um, that, that would be my guess. We didn't get to see the entire story, so this is purely conjecture, but、uh, that would be, I'm pretty sure, a pretty safe guess, right? Okay.、Um, damn, this anime is way too good. Like, it's way too good. I am so excited to see where the story goes and how they end up doing it. I wonder who. Like, because I feel like what, um, is it? Sorry about that.、Uh, is it Masha or Misha? I wonder if, she, like, what she meant with, like, she recognized his name. So I'm guessing it's from the past, from, like,、um, the person who he was、um, hanging out with. I don't know. I feel like it's not Alia. I kind of hope it's not Alia because that would be so, so, so anticlimactic. But. I feel like it would make the most sense for it to be Alia, given this、um, exposition, right? But I don't know. I guess we'll find out as we watch. Maybe it is Alia, maybe it's someone else.、Um, I guess we'll find out.、Uh, I think it's way too early to say, so let's see it. Anyways, I'm going to end it here because this is going to be a long video、uh, already. So, hope you guys enjoyed. If you did, make sure to like, comment, subscribe, and I'll see you in the next one. Peace.